having fun, Arthur? Sure. You don't look like so much fun, boy. That's your fucking hair down like a man. <laughs> Hell, even old man Strauss is more of a laugh than you, boy. Well, thank you, kid. I, I, I'm sorry, Arthur. I, I, I didn't mean it. It's just because I care. You know, it's because I love you, Arthur. Really, it is. No need to bluff. You want one of those little dolls, don't you? Now, how can I ease your troubles? Hello, friend. I don't mean to pry, but, uh, well, you look like something of rough and tumble type. Perhaps somewhat acquainted with the more, uh, colorful elements, if you don't mind me saying. I wonder if perhaps you might have heard anything uh, unsavory okay. about this here establishment of, of recent. A anything r related to violence? No card. Hit me. Shit, let's tip some cows. Well, been a while since you were last here. Take a look. Any questions, feel free not to ask. How's your friend getting on with those new clothes? Not something a lady should be wearing, in my opinion, but each to their own, I suppose. I'd be very surprised if you had a lady, my friend. Well, uh, well, not right now, but I've had my share. Anyway. All right. Mr. Morgan. You okay? I'm bored. Why are you so close, Uncle Arthur? After that hand. Hey, evening to you. Hey. There he is. You want to join us, Arthur? How's it going? Very well. Excellent. You good? Reckon so. Miss Hadley. Hello, Pierce. Mr. Mason? Oh, oh, Mr. Morgan. 
You want to be careful up here? Land is real treacherous. Sure. Real treacherous. I've been here before. Have you? Yes. Funny how things turn out. Never quite how you expect, is it? No, I don't suppose it is. What you shooting? Eagles. You know, the images, they really are beautiful. All thanks to you. I'd be some poor creature's bad meal by now, many times over, but for you. Uh, it's my pleasure. P please, you step away from the cliff edge. I'm trying to get an eagle there, there. Yeah, they're beautiful, but unlike you, they can fly. <laughs> Too true. You really must think I'm a buffoon, don't you? You think I'm such a dimwit, I'd just slip off the edge of a cliff? No, but, well, maybe a little. Please, sir. I'm dense, but not that dense. This area is quite safe. Quite. Quite. Oh, oh! Ah! Damn! You were right. I am that much of a buffoon. Give me a hand, please. Put me out of my misery. Come here. Oh! 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 Thank you. You know what? Bugger the eagles! I'm going home. You know, I really did get some, some amazing pictures, thanks to you. And somehow, I haven't quite broken my neck. You take care. And you too, sir. Sorry for all the trouble. Oh. What in the name of... It looks. How are you? enough for me. Hi, Uncle. Hey, Arthur. You done good, girl. Good morning, sir. Yeah? What do you want? Do I look like a coward to you? I mean, obviously I do, because I look like that milksop there, but tis no matter. Can you help? Maybe. See? Even he is sick of hearing your nonsense, you afterthought of a child. I apologize, sir, for his smell. Why don't we come back here, to somewhere more conducive to displays of utter gallantry and deep-seated inadequacy? Well, what did you have in mind? Shoot a bottle off my head, like William Tell. This is getting silly. Very silly. The man is a moron. <laughs> Shoot one off mine instead. Hey, I'm the brave one. I'm not scared. Uh, I'm a good shot, but... I won't even flinch. I don't want to hurt you, boys. Oh, I can't lose. <laughs> Either I'll prove my masculinity or die and be spared his company. Come, sir, please. Okay, then. <sighs> Listen, just make sure everyone knows you asked me to do this. Of course, of course, of course. You boys are ridiculous. <sighs> okay. Shoot, sir, while our courage holds. Good shot, sir. I didn't bat an eye. What are you both doing? You got it. <laughs> <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> what was? I feel like we didn't even do anything. Oh, of course you didn't. We all know you're hardly sentient at all. Another round, smaller bottles, sir. Please. What? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Please. This creature is unbearable. He needs silencing. I'll do my best. 
As long as she witnesses that I'm doing this under duress. Oh, you boys are so silly. Please, put us out of our misery. Don't think too much about it. Just there goes nothing to fear at all. Come on. Now aim that over here. Are you... Yes! Now I'll stand on one leg! Me too! You keep shooting, sir, and this time you kill the beast. He emerged fully formed from the swamps. Helen! Silence, you blackguard, sir! Shoot the wretch! I'm ready. You're deranged. Shoot away, sir, my bottle and his brains, if you please. At least I have brains. Ready? Aim. Fire! Why? I must be the bravest man I know. Hold still. My turn. Oh, you boys. This is mighty dangerous. Be careful not to hit them. Now do one while I hop. Do one while I turn somersaults. Uh, shoot me. Oh, give me the gun. Let me shoot him. Uh, for all mankind. Uh, I think me and the lady have had enough. Oh, I don't blame you, sir. This man's tongue, I would run too if I could. Here, for your skills and talents. Mm, thank you. Now, brother, I am going to walk Helen home. Don't follow us. She has an elderly aunt, and I fear the sight of you could finally finish her off. Helen, is this creep bothering uh, you? You two, come along. Oh, no, there aren't two. There's me and the lizard man. Please, my angel, do not aggregate us both together. Boys, you are too much. Why, too much. <laughs> Hello, Tilly. Do you realize you look like a backstreet butcher, Mr. Morgan? Hello! Road well. Ooh. Ouch. Get going, will you? No, thanks. I need a bed. I'd keep away from the butcher's sausage. There's a reason he keeps the price so low. Okay, there she is. A real city. The future.